Hello, my lovely, beautiful Pisces. Yo, what's up? What's the dealio, Pisces? All right, I'm Ayana with um, Ayana, your intuitive tarot reader with Divine Vibe Pisces. Uh, I'm going to do some quick ones now. If you already know the routine, I'm just going to make it quick, okay? Um, subscribe, hit the notification bell, make a tip, and our donation, Pisces, book a reading. Everything is down below. My website, divinevibe.org. Okay, Pisces, this is a general reading for you, so it may or may not resonate. Take what's free, leave behind the rest, and keep in mind that other people's energies can be in your reading, Pisces, okay? Um, some of it may resonate, all of it, or none of it. If none of it does, check out another video. All right, Pisces, now, angels, ancestors, spirit guides, all the prayer of my light only. May you watch over my lovely Pisces. May you protect them, guide them, transmit and heal any negative and old energies from their mind, body, and soul. And may you give me a very clear and accurate message from my lovely Pisces. Okay, for the highest good spirit. Now, Pisces, today, if you're tuning in because you're dealing with some, you could be dealing with a fire sign, somebody with heavy fire on a chart, Pisces, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, okay? So, Pisces, let's go ahead. Let me do a quick check in. Let me see what we get. All right, Pisces, let's go. So if you're doing with a fire sign, uh, let's see what we get for Pisces and uh, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. All right, Spirit, give me one card. Five of coins, <laughs> Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, Pisces, this person could be feeling left out in the cold by you. Some of you guys definitely could have walked away. And you definitely um, may not be in communication at this time, Pisces. Okay, definitely in the past there was no communication. Yeah, King of Swords and the um, Queen of Coins could have blocked this person here, Pisces. Um, there could be a parent here. You could be a parent. This is your other half, King and Queen of Swords, Pisces. They could be busy with some type of kids or work situation with the eight of um, pimps, eight of coins here, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So, guys, you could have worked with this person here, um, or you could work with this person. There's not a lot of communication, though. Um, or you met them at work here, Pisces. You could be working, on, just working on your money here, your stability. This person, um, I feel like this, this person is bored and sad, and they're missing you. If you guys have messages, I feel like they're, they are rereading them. This person is trying to figure out how to reach out to you as well, Pisces. You may, yeah, the death card, Scorpio. Some of y'all definitely could have ended this here. Okay, so some of y'all, um, your person could be struggling financially here, but trying to work to get their, um, to keep their money going or flowing. They could have some type of financial situation, um, that is just like, it's not working out, Pisces, and they're pretty sad, okay? Let me clarify really quick. But yeah, Pisces, this person is sad. This, this could be a work situation. I feel like they're struggling here. For some of y'all, they're missing you a lot. Some of y'all could have blocked this person, cut them off. Um, they want some type of transformation here with you, Pisces. Yeah, some of y'all could, yeah, could have ended it here. Clarify this five of coins, but let's let's get a quick clarifier. The moon card, here you go, Pisces, Cancer. Yeah, Pisces, they're definitely missing you. They're in their feelings about you. They're trying to hide this here. For some of y'all, Knight of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. So yeah, yeah, this could have been a work situation for some of y'all. This person's trying to work with you, bring you some type of stability here, Pisces. But they do love you here. Um, they are going to come to you with some type of love, even though you ended it. Some of y'all, y'all could have ended it, and it confused this person here, but they're coming to you here, um, trying to make things right, Pisces. Yeah, Queen of Pentacles, somebody wants a reconciliation. Eight of Pentacles, yeah, they want to work on this with you, Pisces. Um, somebody is definitely a parent here, Pisces, or if not, um, you're very mature, Pisces, very abundant. So this person was confused, Pisces, so you could have ended it. Um, but if you confuse, if you end that, confuse them even more. The moon at the bottom, yeah, this person owes you an apology here with this page of cups from hiding how they, they felt here, felt here, Pisces. I was very can Pisces trust this Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, eight of wands. Yes, you can, Pisces. And they're coming in to give some type of love offer, peace offer here. Spirit say you can trust them when they re when they reach out. They're going to be talking to you with this Eight of Wands. Yeah, they want some good news and communication. They want some rebirth. They want to um, clear up some illusions here with the Moon and the Two of Swords. Yeah, there were some illusions or some the truth wasn't. This person could have been hiding um, what they were truly going through. It could have been some financial situation here, Pisces, um, or some type of work si situation. But they're fixing it. Okay, Four of Wands. 
some of you guys for once 11 11 you can end up marry, marrying this person or being with this person somebody you already know here pisces um 48 or 84 they're coming into you pisces so you guys got to be married okay or this person's wanting to come in with some type of commitment some type of offer some of you guys even wanted a kid here could be seeing angel number 11 11 which fulfillment pisces okay um Let's get a time frame. I'm so big on time frames. We already got this one last time. And we'll get some messages from your person. Okay, give me one card. So yeah, Pisces, some type of wish fulfillment. Somebody, somebody wants to end the confusion here. Okay, they're thinking about you. They want to work on things. 88, they love you. Sacral chakra. Okay, oh, so, uh, put some respect. Some solar plexus chakra between now and three days and three weeks. Okay, um... Expect some change, some changes, communication. Some of you guys even three months, okay? Because it closed out a cycle of three days, three weeks, three months, or three years, Pisces. And they're coming to you with happiness, okay? Uh, you guys will get a chakra, so let me read them. <laughs> okay, because I was like, I'm trying to do this quick. Um, the key facts, okay? The color is yellow. The sound is ram. The element is fire. So Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, fire on fire, Pisces. This person has a lot of passion towards you, and they do love you. The um the glands is the pancreas and the adrenal, okay? The key words is I can. They feel like they can move forward, they can break free from illusions, and they can come to you, Pisces. They're um they're in the feelings about you. The solar plexus chakra is located shit. The low <laughs> the solar plexus chakra is located between the navel area, just below the rib cage. It represents power, vitality, willpower, self-esteem, and confidence. The energy center where your emotions and feelings are recorded. This chakra is associated with the clear assistance inner inner feeling, which is the major psychic reception area. To balance this chakra, you may want to try yoga, dance, and movement or breath work with color. In addition, be aware of people who drain your energy workshops and classes that focus on um, empowerment will help you open and harmonize this area so Pisces you could be like really psychic here okay have a psychic connection with you and this person here they're getting the power to come to you Pisces some of you guys have this inner feeling of already knowing this okay about this connection this person here okay Pisces three could be significant as well 312 323 angels ancestors spirit guides all right, Pisces, so that's very beautiful, so yellow. But um, between our three days, three weeks, some of y'all, even three months, I heard. Um, this person's coming in to you, okay? Yeah, they're having the power. They're passionate about you, Pisces, okay? That would be the first one, but okay, that kind of wanted to fly out. So we'll take all those and then we'll end it, Pisces, okay? They have a lot they want to say, especially if they're holding back. The first card, I know you are intuitive, empath, or psychic here, Pisces. This person, again, as we saw there, you know you're in touch with the divine. Pisces, I let go of the karmic here to come to you. Okay, Pisces, check out the other video. You are my soulmate. So they're not dealing with anybody that could, um, not, no karmic Pisces that's from the past or anybody that's here to just be a blockage. You are their soulmate, their other half. They are healed Pisces to come to you. They have a divine magic stick, okay? They know how to use it in bed. It could be banging Pisces, okay? Divine feminine. So we got divine masculine and divine feminine here on the board. This Pisces, I am in love with you. This person's in love with you, Pisces. You smell good. So they love everything about you. You could um, wear perfume or cologne or have really good hygiene pisces this person is in love with everything about you they wanted they said can i have a second chance with you pisces to make things right you are my earth angel so you're perfect pisces you make miracles happen and you are magical pisces you're a blessing to this person don't say it's officially over some of y'all could have said that y'all done with them but they want you to hold on to them they, they want a second chance i am a past life soulmate so heavy soulmate and heavy i'm in love with you pisces so you could have known this person past life and you guys reincarnated this life lifetime together and like i said pisces i'm struggling financially but they're going to come to you okay um, I'm busy with too much work. Yeah, this person's busy with work. They're struggling. And you're the only person on my mind. So they think about you 24-7. All right, Pisces. So we all watch and, and or do to roll because of you. And I was influenced by other people. And I communicate to you through music. Some of y'all, you could have cooked for them. And nobody compares to you. All right. I love you, Pisces. Like, comment, share, subscribe if this resonated. Hit, um, make a tip in our donation book or reading, Pisces. And I thank you so much for the support. And stay tuned. Amen. Ashe. Namaste.